Disturbing discovery inside the bathroom of a Grays Lake High School. A Nazi swastika posted inside of a bathroom. So the district is now taking disciplinary action against several students. WGN's Julian Cruz is in Grays Lake tonight. Good evening. This disturbing incident happening yesterday at Grays Lake North High School. Administrators not permitted to talk about disciplinary action against what is being described as several students, but people across Grays Lake understandably stunned to hear the news. It definitely is a little shocking knowing that my family is Jewish. Abby Allen and others reacting to the news. It is kind of upsetting to hear that these kids, especially my age, I'm 18, knowing that they're doing that, it's really upsetting. If we're not teaching these kids properly, you know, and, and the parents aren't preparing them properly to learn in school, then what, uh, what, what do you expect? This particular incident, disappointing, it's saddening. Dr. Mikkel Storsley describing the reaction to this, what appears to be a bright red Nazi flag, we blurred out the swastika, discovered on this bathroom wall at Grays Lake North High School. This came from um, a ninth grade world history class, so certainly those teachers are very conscious of their obligation, their responsibility to make sure that students understand this. An internal investigation with the help of video and other evidence identifying the culprits, officials say, the school district saying that there were several ninth graders involved. But Storsley says there's no evidence pointing to a larger problem. This is not a big group of students that were looking to necessarily cause trouble or there's you know, nothing further than that than uh, st students did something, didn't quite think through the implications of their actions. Administrators say this is a teachable moment with the school's history department said to be leading a renewed effort to reinforce core values and to educate the student body on the lessons of history. In Grace Lake, Julian Cruz, WGN News. Chicago